We propose OctaMapRT, the octree-based probabilistic volumetric mapping, using a hybrid of off-the-shelf ray tracing GPUs and CPUs to improve the CPU-based PVM substantially. OctaMapRT builds PVM significantly faster than OctaMap and SuperRay and constructs a map with higher accuracy. OctaMapRT combines both serial CPU tasks and parallel GPU tasks for fast mapping. To speed up voxel determination using ray shooting on the GPU, we first define a shared ray space where ray shooting performs and fill the space with 3D grid voxels. Then we use AABBs to represent voxels and build the shared bounding volume hierarchy of AABBs. This approach reduces memory usage and constructs the bounding volume hierarchy fast. In addition, we use bounding volume hierarchy instancing for large scans. We create a bounding volume hierarchy of a subset of AABBs and reuse it multiple times. To determine voxel state, we shoot rays on BVH in parallel, finding intersected voxels to label free or occupied. Incorrect obstacle spaces can build inaccurate maps when multiple rays cross the same voxel with different classifications. To update a map fast and accurately, we encode voxel state with two bits. If bits equal 1 and 1, and a voxel is labeled as both occupied and free by different rays, then, the voxel is considered occupied over free. Afterwards, all voxels with occupancy information are read from the GPU back to the CPU. Finally, the occupancy probability and octree are updated. Voxel representation and BVH instancing are done beforehand. Then, the rest are repeated in real time as new sensor data is collected. This is the result of map building for four different data sets. We acquire two data sets for EWAS KT building rooms and corridor. On the left, to get sensor measurements, we use a RGBD sensor on a fetch robot, which takes point clouds while exploring the rooms. On the right, we update an octree map using OctaMapRT and point cloud. The voxel colors indicate their height from the ground using height map. We test the mapping speed of EWAS KT building rooms with OctaMapRT, OctaMap, and SuperRay PVMs. The size of the map is 16.5 meters by 24.1 meters by 3.1 meters with 270,000 points per scan. The map is built with voxel sizes of 10 centimeters. We compare OctaMapRT, OctaMap, and SuperRay while building a map from EWAS KT Building's Corridor Point Cloud. The size of the map is 45.5 meters by 33.3 meters by 4.55 meters, with 270,000 points per scan. The map is built with voxel sizes of 10 centimeters. We use FR079 corridor data set from LiDAR sensor and compare building speeds. The size of the map is 46.5 meters by 36.5 meters by 4.45 meters, with 89,000 points per scan. The map is built with voxel sizes of 10 centimeters. Freiburg Campus is a large data set from LiDAR sensors. We compare map building performance. The size of the map is 292.35 meters by 167.05 meters by 27.65 meters with 247,000 points per scan. The map is built with voxel sizes of 10 centimeters. On average, OctaMapRT is 12.7, 11.2, 30.3, and 30.7 times faster than OctaMap from the left of the dataset, respectively. OctaMapRT is also 3.9, 3.8, 4.5, and 4.5 times faster than SuperRay from the left of the dataset, respectively. OctaMapRT builds maps faster than OctaMap and SuperRay in large-scale real-world datasets with dense and high-resolution sensor measurements. OctaMapRT makes more accurate maps with 0.52% higher occupancy grid count than OctaMap and SuperRay, particularly with more free voxels. Thank you.